if you're being blessed by this experience. I said, make some noise if you're being blessed by this experience. See, today we didn't just come to sing and dance. We came to bring more than a song to you. We came to bring more than how good we look, how well we sing, how well we play. We came to bring Jesus to you. I have more than a song today. I brought myself. I am the sacrifice. And I have more than a song today. I brought myself. I am your worship. And I have more than a song.
There's a pulpit in front of me. But like I said, this isn't just a concert. It isn't something that we're just here to come and sing and look good and make you laugh and make you dance, you know. We are here to experience God. We are here to experience Jesus, our maker. And I don't know who is sat in this room today. I don't know if you're a believer, if you're not a believer. I don't know what you're going through right now with God. But I'm here to bring you more than a song. This is the keys experience. We want to go back home. We want to go back to our families. We want to go back with the keys that allow us to have an experience with God. I don't think you heard me. We want to go back with the keys that allow us to have an experience with God. Not just in this room, not just in this place, but when we go back home, that we will be able to experience Him. So like I said, I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what you're facing with God. I don't know where you are with God right now, but I'm here to remind you of who He is, of how great He is, of how Marvelous he is. King Jesus, my Savior, Redeemer, Kanamata, Strong Tower, everything I need. He is everything you need. He is everything you need. Is everything you need. The Lord is my shepherd and I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures still. Oh, and he leads me beside the still waters. Said he
sure you've all guessed what verse I am quoting, what verse I am singing from. Psalm 23, it says, The Lord is my shepherd and I shall not want. You see, the Lord is a good shepherd. So I'm reminding you that every need that you have, every need that you are asking of Him, anything that you are requiring of Him, He is a good shepherd. My Bible says that the Lord will supply all my needs according to His riches and glory. Not by my mind, not by my strength, not by my wisdom, not by how well I can sing, but by His riches. He is our strength. He is our provider. That is why we call him Jehovah Jireh, because he is our provider. He is my healer. That is why I call him Jehovah Nissi. What can God not do for you? What can he not give to you? He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness. And now this is my favorite part, my personal favorite. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. Hey, I will fear no evil. I don't think you heard me. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. Oh, I will fear no evil. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, I will fear no evil. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, I will fear no evil. Hey.
is that God didn't promise you that it will be easy. God didn't say that it will be a smooth journey. But he says, yea, though we walk through the valleys of the shadow of death, we 